Well, today's weather, rain was really not a problem this morning in Brunswick. That's when I had the rare opportunity to fly along with a special group of aviators who write messages in the sky for all to see. The Geico Sky Typers. These planes are part of aviation history. A few of the remaining World War II North American SNJ-2 planes left in the entire world. And today, I had a chance to fly in one. High up in the sky over Brunswick, it was a whole new experience for me, flying with some of the best aviators in an aircraft built to fight in a war more than 70 years ago. These aircraft were actually built uh, to train pilots for the Second World War. But today, these planes are being used for something else, to entertain and amaze thousands of people each year at air shows. And what they do is unique, writing messages in the sky with puffs of smoke. What we do is we have five airplanes that fly in a line of breast formation and computer activated, it puts giant messages in the sky, kind of like a dot matrix fashion. So we are the largest text messengers in the world. The real art for us is to maintain perfect formation while the computer actually s sends out the signals to the aircraft through data link when they are to smoke. So the smoking's done by the computer, but the flying's done by us. Aviators, he says, who are mostly former military pilots and current airline pilots who have between seven and 8,000 plus hours under their belts. And they all have one thing in common, their love of performing in these old planes in air shows. We do about a dozen a year, and we travel mostly up and down the East Coast. Now, this is the northernmost point of our, of our schedule this year. It's a great experience. I consider myself very fortunate to be able to uh, be part of this group. I'm sure it was a great experience for me. Could have stayed up there all day. All right. Well, you can check out the Sky Typers for yourself at the Great State of Maine Air Show, taking place at the Brunswick Executive Airport tomorrow through Sunday. And for more information, check out our website, WMTW.com.